because there's been a disaster in Christchurch in New Zealand. What are your thoughts? Well, it's been so recent. It's only been five hours ago. Um, so it's very difficult for us to comment because information changes so quickly as we found out from the Queensland floods that more and more information gathers as the hours go. So if we say anything too definite, it's going to change within the hours. But from what we can see, um, the, the images of the cathedral, the tower collapsing, the old buildings collapsing, everybody's very upset. We don't know about the death toll yet at this point of time. Yeah, you've seen all these buildings. Um, I have indeed. Well, of course, as we all know, Australia's had its fair share of disasters recently. I've been to Christchurch in New Zealand many times, an absolutely beautiful city. It almost looks English in many ways, so it reminds me of England, but it is tragic to see those pictures of the cathedral partly destroyed. I think one of the steeples has come down. Many of the familiar buildings and the main streets have been destroyed. And to see many people in Christchurch feeling helpless but of course the emergency services have been brilliant from what I've seen and here in Sydney and Australia they've been running live footage of the main New Zealand TV channels and their news networks. What do you think New Zealand could learn from Australia about disasters? I think it's really, I, I, I really don't think you could compare because a cyclone and a flood you have a certain amount of warning. And so I think Anna Bly in Queensland was absolutely brilliant as a leader in um, leading through the disaster. Everything that came up, she was like this with the emergency. Um, she was right on. Her finger was right on the buzzer whenever the emergency um, people knew something. She was right in the emergency room. She knew it, everything by step by step and had broadcast by broadcast just so that everybody knew and to be rest assured that you know everyone was um, up to date. Well I hope that whatever happens, I know that John Key is flying to Christchurch this afternoon but this is the third disaster in very few months. They had the Christchurch earthquake last year in September, they had the helicopter crash, and now another earthquake in Christchurch. But we do wish everybody in Christchurch and New Zealand and all their families and loved ones the best of luck. And I can tell you that the faults of Australians this side of the ditch, this side of the pond, are very much with the New Zealanders, our New Zealand brothers and sisters. Would you agree on that one? Absolutely, if there is an, if there is an emergency donation line, or a help line. Um, I don't know if it's up yet. We've only got the 1300 line for the families to contact. But whenever the donation line comes up, make sure you do give to Queensland. You know, New Zealanders gave to Queenslanders and we owe it back to New Zealand. And um, our thoughts and prayers are with you in New Zealand. Um,